Hello, I'm Dr. Ray Sand. Welcome back to this introductory course in interplanetary musicology. In today's lecture, we'll look at the music of Mars. Mars was the first place after the moon to be colonised and has a long history and a rich culture. Many musical styles are connected with gatherings or parties or rituals that take place when communities are isolated by dust storms that can last for days. Perhaps the biggest pop star on Mars is Cheb Almiric, who plays an upbeat modern take on this music. Some cities are very old and have developed sophisticated classical traditions. Mars is unusual as there are both urban and rural areas. Farms on Mars are networks of interconnected field domes, so workers and crops are protected from the freezing temperatures, solar radiation and unbreathable air. The character of these sparsely populated areas is proudly different to the large cabin cities like Cassius, and so is the music. <laughs> Mars has two moons, Phobos and Deimos. Here is a Phobos eclipse as seen from Mars. Phobos and Deimos had a reputation as being functional and dull places. That was until the crater punk scene exploded out from Phobos, a sound that changed rock music throughout the solar system. <laughs> 